We have to deal with stress and pressure during volleyball games. Uh, there are also many rallies uh, which cost us a lot of energy. That's why I have for you very demanding exercise which will help you to overcome these tough times during game. Hi, I'm Jerry Popelka, Volley Country founder. I'm speaking about volleyball advice, tips and exercises. Subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to turn your notification on. I played league in many countries, but this tough exercise I will never forget. Sometimes it was like volleyball slaughterhouse. The exercise is coming from times when I played in Noliko Mazeik and we won the Belgian league and cup two times. It was kind of exercise to stimulate stress and demanding situation like in a game. There was a complete team of six players on one side, defensive team. On the other side there were only two spikers and setter, offensive team. The goal of exercise for offensive team was to reach 10 points. The goal for defensive team was to defend or block offensive team and score a point too. The offensive team got easy ball to pass to setter. Setter was in comfortable position, so he was setting fast sets to position 2 or position 4. There was no middle blocker in offensive team, so you could expect a double block from defensive team even on these fast sets. If the defensive team catch your attack in defense, they had the right to play whatever they want to score a point. If they get point, the offensive team is losing one point and you can go even to minus points. I remember when I was one of these spikers uh, with the goal to reach 10 points, it wasn't easy. From the beginning I felt under pressure, in a stress, because I knew that we have to score every single set. Otherwise, the defensive team has a big advantage. They are a complete team of six players. If I attack out, minus point for us. If they block me, minus point again. If they defend me in the field, they can attack the way they want against single block and three defending players on the other side. So again, probably minus point for our team. I knew you have to be almost perfect in attack to complete this task. Otherwise, you can expect many jumps and coming fatigue. I have to confess that once we made such exercise and in three minutes our offensive team was minus nine points. Can you imagine what kind of effort and time it took us to get to 10 points? We spent another 20 minutes just to get to zero and another 25 minutes to reach 10 points. 45 minutes of jumping and attacking in two players against complete defense. Yes, it was very physically demanding, but more importantly, I felt big pressure from the fact that we have to score every single set. I was in stress. I had to score. I learned from the first attack till the last one. I have to be 100% focused, no time to take a break. And defensive team didn't make it easy for us. They didn't let us uh, score for free. Because once we have reached 10 points, we came to defensive side and the other two spikers had to complete this demanding uh, task. So coming to defensive team was kind of a revenge for us. We did everything to stop other two spikers to keep them attacking for a long time. And sometimes our training was just about this one exercise. We were lucky because we had normally three hours to finish our training. On the other hand, it was great preparation and simulation of the game. Volleyball will be always about attack, you get most points from it. I learned that uh, when you attack, every set can be a point and you have to do everything to score a point. To attack a short diagonal, to use block out, to search for fingers, to use tip after three powerful attacks. I didn't want to give a chance to defensive team to defend my attacks. And at the end I mostly attack uh, these fast sets with everything I had uh, using tips only a few times. So this is just an example of one exercise. Use these kind of exercises and take them as a great preparation for the match. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.